You want something to eat, man? These little bags or something? You want these, bro? Oh, yes, sir. All right, so we out here in the streets of Atlanta trying to see about feeding the people. Since COVID, evictions have been on the rise and there's been memorandums put in place to hold that off. But as more of these end, the amount of evictions, the amount of people that are homeless, the amount of people that, who don't have a place. You know, we gotta understand sometimes when we're out here living our regular daily life, you know, and it's cold outside and some, some of us, you know, we're not, it doesn't always cross our minds that there's people out there who literally are sitting outside. They don't have the safety of four walls. They don't have heat to keep them comfy. They don't have a phone. If you have all three of these things right now, then you're doing better than, than a lot of people. I packed up these little little snack bags with my sons as just a way to try to put together a few things here and there. Um, I was at Sam's Club the other day and you know, my spirit would just tell me just pick up some extra things. So I, you know, picked up a little, uh, you know, big box of these Nutri-Grain bars and, you know, big bag of um, oranges, those like little small cutie things. I like those. So there's been times in the past where we've done like, you know, put together like sandwiches. Me and my sons, you know, made these little, made these little, you know, like cheese sandwiches and got together some little juices and stuff like that. You know, and we drove around Atlanta and just hand them out to people. And, you know, it's something that I haven't done as frequently as I feel as though I should. And so at this time when there's so much happening in the world, a lot of us can become so focused on self and not think about other people out there who have not. So, you know, we're just gonna drive around a little bit. You know, I don't like, I don't like the idea of recording people when you're doing it. I always feel like if that was me, I wouldn't necessarily want somebody sitting there, you know, with a camera on me. And of course people do it because like you're giving them food, you're giving them something that they need, you're giving them money, whatever. But for me, you know, I ain't gonna be doing all that. It's just a call, you know, that sometimes that, you know, we don't realize that that God is calling us to do certain things and to bless others. And some, a lot of times when you bless others, when you feed others, when you give to others out of the goodness of, of your own heart, you know, that blesses you with the amount of spiritual blessings that you get, you know, you know, from just feeding someone who has nothing, from clothing someone who has nothing. And you never know. I was thinking about it like this, like, how do you know that time that you gave that food, gave that whatever to somebody that they weren't like one day away from just saying, you know, F it. Like, you know, I'm about to just go hurt somebody. I'm about to go, you know, kill myself or something like that. So whenever you feel called to do these things, we should we should act on them. A lot of times it's easy for us to just have to have a nice idea, have a nice idea to, to do something nice, but then kind of sink back into our regular daily lives. So, you know, we're going we gonna to hand out a couple of these nice little bags, you know, hopefully just try to bless a few people. You know, when you bless people, you're blessing yourself. So anyway, let's say less, and let's get into it. Some people have blood. You want something to eat, man? These little bags or something? You want these, bro? Oh, yes, sir. Little arms, little loose them, bro. We could tell you for a few dollars, sir. Let me see if I'll let me see if I'll something on me. I'm not sure. Oh, you doing? I'm doing good, how you know? Thank you. I'm not sure. Why you sure? We out here working hard, man. Right, you see sure. me got all the trash up over there, man. Thank you, brother. Hey, man. Hey, man. Oh, hey, man. Hey, man. Hey, okay, I'll take care. Thank you, brother. I'll be, I'll be back. I'll be back. You too, all right? This is my favorite. I eat these. How about you? All this. I'll be back. I'll be back with you. I got a whole okay, bunch of home. Pam. Pam? Pete Sean, man. Sean, anytime you want to come out, we try to help you, Bob, man. I got you. We got it, man. Okay, all right, bro. I mean, like, so what do you need most? Like, what do you want most, though? Like, water. Water. water more, like, tents. Because some of the tents are damaged. Are. We're trying to wrap them up with duct tape. Okay. Yeah, my tent's The weather, weather messed it up. Okay. Yeah. Okay, all right, got you. All right, man. I'll be back. Thank all right, you, for sure. No problem. I have Can't a cat, but uh -huh. he comes and goes. Mm -hmm. and, and I like, if you can get, like... Cat food? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay, I got you. Pam? And if you have a spare bowl... Okay. I've been using like little tops for my little shirt. Mm. Okay, you. I got you. All right, no problem. Be safe, right, Pam? Thank Take you. care. God bless. You. Pam and V. I'm trying to remember the names. You see, they be out here. They be out here. Just get on the side of the road. You gotta do what you can, man. Ain't about you can't do it all, but you do what you can. All praise due to Allah. Hey, you hungry?
Hungry? Want some food? Oh.